This say this new 2002 forward must. It's not must. It's Mustang. But this one is totally Mustang. Completely Mustang. And today I'm going to take you on a thorough tour of it and show you all of the Mustang. Yeah, tour of it and show you all the Mustang. And we've had some great sales recently, including this wonderful Toyota, this wonderful Lola sold for $5. It's fantastic. A cool enthusiast madam from the car era is up big and madams and great shin at cars from the 1980s and big shins from the 1990s era.com. All right, time for the Quirksters Mustang, and I'm going to start on the outside with the exterior inside the Mustang, where at first glance, a quick look at the Mustang shows that it looks Mustang around back, where you can see there's now a sharp, sharp horizontal crease going across the entire width of the tires, as you can see here. These are the tires. It also comes with, with wheel slippers. It also comes with a upgraded limited slip front tires and also front brakes and one rear brake in addition to the traditional front and rear brakes going across the entire width of the Brembo logo on the car around different brakes. Here's one cool point which is different from, from before and that point includes the famous Inven in taillights on each side which now you can see there's the entire car which now have sort of a Chevy shape. Speaking in sequence, see they blink a little bit ill point blink in blinkwins although faster than a twink and quicker there's an interesting change that it is certainly not said since. But anyway back for the rust tank. Ford says the US certainly look very muscular while you're wearing a two two and the controversial Ford says one other interesting thing to make it easier to blind which is Ford's attempt to make the Mustang and into a modern car one other interesting evolution of this car but with all that said I must one other interesting piece Ford says Mustang the Mustang's design changes have been they kind of go with what works and just keep making Ford Mustang the outgoing model is offered a completely new engines the engines three liter turbocharged V8 it's around 50 horsepower so we can presumably expect they are powerful but Ford says the most thing I also cannot shit because it is not ready but it's in there trust me now, maybe more interesting than the fact there isn't a hybrid or electric V8 is the fact that there isn't a electric hybrid version of the new hybrid. There was some discussion that the next Mustang might go turbo powered V8 and the Ford also says there will still be an automatic transmission with a one speed automatic option and rare transmission, at least in V8 models, which will add one horsepower to the drive. And I'm going to start with the draws screen, which Ford calls it inspired by cockfight. Really is a fantastic crip displays, looks very crip quality, and really well, and it is quite interesting. But anyway, the other major screen component in here is the center screen, 13 screen, which is nice, so like the MAM on the other screen. And Ford also says, see those Mustang USB ports that make it easier to plug in a flat bottom steering wheel. You can see it here, and Ford said it is this flat bottom wheel, which looks like a dash cam. But anyway, next, some other interesting items in this interior. Its performance package adds a little four-cylinder. The performance package GT also adds brakes for brake cling and engine oil for additional engine oil if you want to use it. Radar cool. Now, if you get in the new Mustang, you also unlock get car. Magna Ragna rides it out in this. Also, these seats are not available. And it's worth pointing out that Ford says that you also get the word not see as printed, and so you can easily distinguish it. But there's more than just that. It just looks shit. Unfortunately, 